old office all cleared out. Basically the end of one chapter. We moved in here March, 2022. Left April, I guess. It's been a wild couple of weeks moving. We doubled in size basically. And we're moving on to the next spot. We didn't go far. We're in distance of the new one. Which made it easier, it did make it easier to move because we didn't have to actually transport anything, but you can clip in a video of a new sh skateboarding stuff back and forth. That's kind of how the past week went. I definitely did not realize how much stuff we could have fit in here and also how much room we had with the ceilings if we were able to lift stuff up. And now that it's empty, it looks a lot smaller because we have so much shit like laid over the, all over the place in the new one that it's like, I don't know how it was. It, everything that was in there basically was in here other than like two or three half pallets, which is no big deal. We could have easily broken those down and gotten them in. I don't know how we had all this stuff. Like this is literally all the same stuff that was in the other side. I don't know how it all fit in there, but it did. We had the forklift too. But we just gave that back today. We were we had that for the truckload and for the move. We're gonna get a new one, something small, so that way we can actually fit through that little hallway, be nimble in here. But new warehouse, time to fill it up. Hello. Whoever finds a profitable item first wins. And it has to be at least 30% minimum ROI, and it's gotta be selling at least 100 times a month. Do you think these are duds, Anoush? Uh, look, kinda looks like it, but maybe we can find one or two. Ten I found ten. one. Let's go, baby. <laughs> look at the buy cost, guys. Zoom that in, baby. How much is that? 15 beans, baby. And how much is it going for? 58.99. 100% ROI, right there, 58.99. Rank 200K, but we're buying one of them. We're gonna sell. It's 100% R. Do you want this item, Joe? Yeah. Or should no, I take it? You have it. 15 bucks. I've only been here for like 15 minutes, maybe 10 minutes. Right? That's one item. We're gonna go ahead and keep stacking. I haven't done any keeper research yet, but I'll do it after. Dude, I just beat you, Anoush. What do you mean? That's 100% ROI. This is more. Oh, what is it? How much is it? Pandemic game. 1939 payout, 750 buy cost. Let's say another, what would this be, $1.25? Oh yeah, it's 100, like 20% ROI. Son of a gun. Yeah, right here. Good shit, bro. There's four of them, pandemic game. Make, I don't know how much money, but it's profitable. Oh, actually this one's really good. Hey, I found another one, bro. $10 profit. And you buy for 25. That's like 40% ROI. We'll take it. This one's actually good to keep, I just checked. If you see exclusively at Walmart, you don't want to touch that. 10, 20, 30, $40. This is a $25 payout profit. That's like, we've been here for like, what, 20 minutes now? You gotta buy this. What is it? $5 each, uh -huh. rank, 1,200. Holy shit. Pays out, 1,221, $5. That's like 100% ROI. One dollar ship in. It's like a hundred nick. That's a hundred nick, bro. <laughs> Are you crazy? That's one hundred nick. Dude, they have Addison Ray Barbie. Dude, nobody wants this shit. This is not our game. Just a heads up. We're just showing you guys that you can make money doing this. It's not hard. Let me show you how this product makes over two hundred and ninety-four dollars profit per unit on Amazon. You can see after payout and shipping, it pays out $294 profit every single month, ranked under a thousand. RA winners. Oh she's a bad thing. Finding hell. Thick as fuck. Oh my god. Deva. I'm unstickering him right now. So then the fucking customers don't bitch at me saying, you need a lean. <laughs> Allergies have started. It's like 40, it's like 80 degrees out. I took allergy medicine and I can't breathe. My eyes are really red. This is a day raw in the flesh at the warehouse. Sometimes they say wake up and smell the roses, but it's now 80 degrees in April in Jersey and some of us have the worst allergies ever and we sniffle all day. And that's what it's like when you're prepping these units and there's dust all over the place. We have the doors open because it's so hot. The new warehouse we're now in for a week. It's Thursday. We've been in, moved in, out of the old place for a week now and it's starting to come together. 
It's like a new year, same me type of deal. Or new year, new me. I'm just kind of bullshitting here. This is raw. I had a me I had like a vision of like a talking cutscene for the vlog. We don't really have too much going on because we were like out of space. We had to give the forklift back. Still doing some training. Just trying to like get settled in. <laughs> the allergies. A year spent in these walls. <laughs> the funny thing is we're doing the same thing in the other spot. We're still dealing with Anusha's returns. Still waiting on freight to get picked up because of the Jewish holiday that's going on right now. But I'm really excited. Great Discord call last night. That was good too. Had a bunch of stuff going on there. I did not realize that AJ does like two, 300k a month. That's sick. He's probably the biggest seller inside of our Discord, members-wise. A lot of you guys have issues with finding distributors. Um, I think one of the things to touch on is that you don't want somebody to just hand you a list of distributors. You wanna learn how to find them, how to contact these guys. You have to know, too, that like you're not gonna know how good a distributor is for the long term when you just do one order. Like You're gonna have to do some business with them to really see what they're capable of. A lot of the best deals come out six months down the line. TJ, where you been at? Have another truckload coming in a couple weeks. Um, we'll have some small orders going here and there, but we're still doing like 2,000 you know, units a day-ish, which is okay. Opening up prep soon is gonna be really exciting. I like that business. I think it's a really good cash flow. I hope that we can continue to do that and build that out to where we can, you know, it's a great way to grow your warehouse op because you're gonna constantly have clients coming in. But the thing is, it is kind of a logistical nightmare. So we gotta set some minimums because it only helps to like, the best things that we could do for clients to save them money is to ship volume for them and like drive rates down in everywhere that we can. And like, I don't wanna prep just a couple hundred units because we're not gonna be able to actually save them money, but we'll see how that goes too. I'm gonna get up. $15 Shopify store. I really like that. I like that clip of Dom. Reel it in. I got the bag. Tell a friend. She got some ass. Bring it in. Nels, I think I watched our last vlog or the truckload vlog like six times. At least. Wow. You Jordan a pippin'. I'm Kobe, I'm never gonna dish it. I'll miss it. 